My name is Katarina and welcome to my channel. I wasn't really sure if I wanted to talk in my videos or have music playing in the background, so I decided to test out and talk a little bit so I could explain what I'm doing. So yeah, I hope you will enjoy the video. So now you see me sketch out the idea that I have and I figured out that I wanted to make a cute little character because I wanted to make something that represented me and that may not make sense for you uh, but I'm gonna talk a little bit about it and a couple of years ago I got a nickname uh, which is Mashimu and that nickname doesn't really make sense uh, it was just because I really enjoyed eating marshmallows uh, many years ago and suddenly my friend just said out of the blue that my new nickname would be Marsimu. So a couple of years later I figured out okay it would be really cool to make a character based off of that name and therefore I maybe thought that I could do this for a YouTube video and this is this character. So I decided to make something really cute, adorable and something that would maybe represent me a little bit and what I really love using is hoodies. Uh, because it's so comfortable and I think most people do enjoy just wearing hoodies every day So that's kind of why I wanted to have that on the character and I also decided to make really huge eyes simply because it's easy <laughs> to make and I also don't need to worry about posing the character or like do anything uh, detailed Which is also why I chose not to have any details on the feet or the hands. And the lack of details on something also makes something more cute and adorable. So it's way simpler to just do it that way. The name Mashimu is something that I have used a lot in my past, but I didn't really feel it was something that I was using well and I wasn't really sure how to use it well and what I could use it for. So making this character really helped me get out of that bubble and not worrying about okay what should I use this name for. So it really helped me just getting started on this character and making this video because not only could I make something that would represent a name but I could also make something that represented me. So I will probably end up using this character more in the future which is really fun to think about that I now finally have a character and I finally get to use the name Mashimu.
moment right now you can see that I am starting to finish the base of the model and I kind of struggled a little bit with the ears as well as the hoodie but I think I ended up with something that I'm really happy with. In the beginning I also started to think about if I should make this in the second program that I'm gonna use which you will see in a short while. But I decided to start with this program which is called Maya because then you will see the whole process and where I start my base and just how I make everything from scratch. So now you see me moving on to the details and I think this is my favorite part because it's so relaxing and it's so fun and I don't really have to worry about making any mistakes and at this point I already have the model, I already have the character ready. So the only thing I need to do is, you know, the details. And that's also why it's just so fun because I can see everything coming together and I can choose if I want and I can choose if I want to have more details or if I want to have less details and I just really enjoy using this program. If you haven't done a lot of 3D modeling and are wondering about what types of programs I'm using I have wrote that down in the description and right now I am using something called ZBrush and ZBrush is a program that I use to make details and sculpting and it's a program that most people use to make organic objects while the other program is used to make more hard surface models. So I always start in Maya and making the character or making the thing so I can move on to this program and then adding the details. And after adding the details I will be able to put what I have on this thing together with the first one I made <laughs> and that will probably not make sense for you at the moment. But I promise you, it will make sense. <laughs> and right now <laughs> I am doing something called baking, which is basically putting those two characters together. So I will have the details on the character, but it's not on the character, <laughs> if that makes sense. That's something that I could probably explain a little bit better in another video if you are interested in knowing more about 3D modeling and how everything works. But right now I'm just showing you briefly how I make something and just scratching the surface. And <laughs> talk about surface, I am now adding the colors. And this step is so fun and I enjoy it so much because it kind of reminds me of the children books you have when you are little and you are trying to color in, in between the lines. But since this is a program on a computer, I have more freedom and I can choose more freely what I want to have as colors. And if I choose one color, I can always undo it or I can pick another color. So this program is so cool and I love it so, so much.
So this is how the character Mashimu ended up looking like and I'm really happy with the result and I hope you enjoyed watching the video as much as I liked making the video and I will see you in the next video. Bye!